it's uh, obvious for um, for all the observer that uh, the collapse of this country is going to impact uh, the re the whole region. Uh, since the Seleka took over last year, there's been uh, a lot of security incidents. Uh, for instance, at the border with Cameroon, uh, even uh, some uh, security personnel in Cameroon have been killed. There is a flow of refugees in eastern Cameroon and uh, there's already the dynamics of, uh, of destabilization on the eastern Cameroonian border. Uh, so all the governments in the region are now fully aware that uh, the collapse of CAR is, uh, is, can be uh, destabilizing. Uh, first because of, uh, of the move of uh, militiamen and armed groups to their territory and secondly also because there is a fear that uh, what's going on, uh, uh, especially uh, those attacks against the Muslim community, uh, can attract actually some uh, Muslim radicals coming from other countries. Chad has uh, basically uh, two uh, main concerns when it comes to the Central Africa Republic. The first concern is of course security because in the past uh, some uh, opponents uh, managed to use Central African Republic as a base uh, for, for armed opposition, I mean. And uh, there is also uh, a very uh, significant economic interest in the sense that uh, there is uh, most of the cattle uh, from Chad is uh, migrating to, uh, to Central African Republic during the dry season. And so this is very important for uh, Chad because cattle is playing uh, a big role in the Chadian economy, and it's also a big, uh, uh, it's also a big social uh, social uh, thing in uh, in um, Chadian society. Um, so uh, those are the two main interests. There are some people who talk, of course, about uh, oil because the oil fields in Chad are, are not far from the border of Central African Republic. So there's a whole speculation that there might be some uh, oil also in the northern part of CAR and uh, that in fact uh, this is driving the strategy of N'Djamena. Um, I think uh, there, is a, there is maybe an element of truth in, in that, but uh, it still has to be uh, demonstrated that there is oil in Central African Republic.